Uh, so welcome back guys my name is Amran and in today's make all free campaign we go about looking at how we can solve this issue of some app not working on your Android smartphone. Now it may so happen that maybe Facebook is not working or maybe WhatsApp is not working or maybe some of the UPI apps are not working on your smartphone. Now why this happens sometimes the app during an Android update or maybe while you are using the application some of the data may get corrupted or something may happen and in those cases what you simply need to do is you simply need to go towards settings you need to go towards applications so you can search for applications so once you are on your applications you actually search for the app so suppose for me one mg app is not working say for a moment let's assume it's not working what i can do is i can just simply open the app and you will see like I have some storage being used here so I can just clear the data and clear the cache a cache is automatically cleared when you clear the data so like once you do this and you can also then force stop the app and then try using the app and it will absolutely work fine and I'm not just talking of 1MG so you can just figure out what the problematic app is maybe in your case it's Uber so you can actually we just did it a few moments back what we did was like it was not working and we actually you don't have to uninstall this you simply have to have a full stop and then like you know you simply clear off the data and clear off the cache so you can like clear off the cache and then clear off the data as well and what this does is like now when you use the app it's almost as if you're using a fresh installation so you have to create an account again but at least you will be able to use the app so like now what happens is say I want to go ahead and use Uber so I can actually pretty well go ahead and use this. So for people like who may not be able to add banks on the UPI app or maybe WhatsApp is not kind of opening figuring out a way. Well besides installing the latest version you may also go ahead and try you know like deleting the storage of that app from the applications like this and maybe this will help you figure out how to use the app. And if this helps, consider subscribing, click on the bell icon for notifications and put down your comments in the comment section. So I'll just repeat the step once more. Just simply go to your settings, go to apps and inside the app, figure out the faulty app. Once we have figured out the faulty app, just go ahead, give it a full stop and then like go to storage, clear cache, clear data. And well, you are perfect to go. So God bless. Goodbye guys.